Number 15. Show that 60 liters of gasoline originally at 15 degrees Celsius will expand to 61.1 liters when it warms to 35 degrees Celsius. All right, so we're talking about a volume expansion. So let's first start with this formula that deals with uh, volume expansion due to thermal change. So here it says that the change in volume will be equal to the coefficient of thermal expansion for the liquid we're talking about multiplied by the initial volume multiplied by the change in temperature. Now remember the change in temperature is always, or change here is always general, uh, generally final minus initial. Okay, so I can just kind of erase that and do final minus initial. All right. Now, uh, what we need to do is we need to show that 60 liters of gas will expand to 61 liters. So another thing we can do is simply now expand on the change in volume. And remember, I can just erase this and call it, since it's a change, it's going to be final minus initial. Okay, so here's my formula. Now, if I want to show that it will expand to 61.1 liters, basically what I can do is solve this formula for the final volume. And if I do that, I just have to add this term on over to the right-hand side, right? So doing that would give me now the final volume will be equal to the coefficient of thermal expansion multiplied for gasoline, that is, multiplied by the initial volume of that gasoline times then the final temperature minus the initial temperature, then added to the initial volume. Now, we always need the standard units, right? We need uh, cubic meters. So all of these values here, converting liter into cubic meter, remember, just take these and divide it by 1,000, aka move the decimal three places to the left. All right. So let's just plug it on in. So we have the final volume here will be equal to the coefficient, and that I wrote down. This you have to look up. So this is 950 times 10 to the minus 6, multiplied by that initial volume of 0 0.06 cubic meters. All right times and the final temperature, which is 35 degrees Celsius minus the initial, which is 15, then added to the original uh, volume. And literally all we have to do now is just plug it on in, right? So there's going to be 950, 950 times 10 to the minus 6, multiplied by 0 0.06, multiplied by then uh, 35 minus 15, and then add to that 0 0.06. And what do we get? We get 0... 0 0.06, 0 0.06, looks like 1, 1. Ah, converting, remember this is in cubic meters, converting that into liters, just multiply that by 1,000, and we get our answer of now 6.11 liters. Oh, excuse me, 61.1 liters. There you go. Just seeing if you guys are paying attention. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in. Hope this helped. Please remember to subscribe. See you next time.